Championship Saturday on the mats in Columbus at the State Wrestling Tournament. And for LCC's Hunter Lucas, it's a chance to close out his high school career as a state champion. Last year, Lucas finished as the state runner-up at 113 pounds. The seniors wrestled his way back to the championship match, this time around at 120. And the Parade of Champions, always a special and unique way to start the festivities. 120 pounds, there's Mr. Lucas taking on Delta's Drew Matten, state champion last year at 106. Second period, Lucas down 1-0. Matten gets called for an illegal hold. Point for Lucas. We're tied at one after three. Still tied, so a scoreless one-minute extra period. Then Hunter is in the up position for the fifth. Matten kicking madly, gets the escape for the point. Goes up two to one. Sixth period, the rolls are reversed. Lucas on the bottom needs at least one point to continue the match. Trying to get free, but he's out of bounds. Lucas falls 2-1 at OT. A back-to-back -back state runner-up for the future Maryland Terrapin. There's George Clemens at 126, the Wayne Trey senior, wrestling for an undefeated season. First period, Clemens the aggressor against Genoa's Damian D'Amelio gets control. Two points in the early lead. Third period. Clemens up 2-1 if he can hang on both figuratively and literally and win the state championship. D'Amelio cannot escape in time and George Clemens, the winner, the undefeated state champion. What exhilaration. His defiance is Robbie Bowers finishes second in the 185-pound D2 class. Patrick Henry's heavyweight. Brandon Bennett finishes second as well in D3. George Clemens wraps up his career by sharing the same dream as his dad. He's it was just, just a big accomplishment, it's a big sense of happiness, I guess. It's just something I've worked for ever since I've been little. I'm um, just preparing all my life just for that match, just to, just to win that match, especially by one point. Um, it's just a great feeling of accomplishment. Um, I knew my arms were tired, my legs were tired, and my knee, I couldn't really feel my leg from my uh, original knee pad, so they had to take that off. I just knew holding for 13 seconds and I could get a state championship, and I did just that. I'm so excited. I'm just happy I could be able to get that. Hold on to it. Um, he's always, ever since I've been little, started in the sport at three years old, always talks about coaching his first state champion, how he thought I could be the first, um, just always pushing me to be as hard as the best that I could um, to be a state champion. And now I finally accomplished that. I'm glad I could give that back to him for all the time he put into me.